Mrs. Lee, I believe you have some words to say about the dearly departed. I'm not going to sing praises for my late husband. Not today. Neither am I going to talk about how good he was. Enough people have done that here. Instead, I want to talk about some things that will make some of you feel a bit uncomfortable. First off, I want to talk about what happened in bed. Ever had difficulty starting your car engine in the morning? Well, that's exactly what David's snoring sounded like. But wait, snoring wasn't everything. There was also this rear-end wind action going on as well. Some nights, it would be so forceful, it would wake him up. What was that? He would ask. Oh, it's the dog, I would say. Go back to sleep, dear. Oh, you might find this all very funny, but towards the end of his life, when his illness was at its worst, these sounds indicated to me that my David was still alive. And what I wouldn't give just to hear those sounds again before I sleep. In the end, it's these small things that you remember, the little imperfections that make them perfect for you. So to my beautiful children, I hope one day you too find yourselves life partners who are as beautifully imperfect as your father was to me.